Hey everybody, just a quick video today to show you something that I picked up to make my life a little bit easier, um, and maybe it'll make your life easier too. Uh, what I did was I picked up a couple of CASA smart plugs. These are Wi-Fi smart plugs by TP-Link. I have no allegiance to TP-Link, which I've said before on this channel, so maybe it sounds a little suspect at this point because I keep showing TP-Link stuff, but the reason I got this specifically is because it's supported by BitFocus Companion, and I have a Stream Deck on my desk. And uh, just by virtue of my setup here, I've got speakers on either side of me, and I have a sub in the corner, and it's hard to get to the on-off switch without bumping other things, knocking lights out of the way. And also sometimes I just leave the room at night and forget to turn stuff off. So with these things, I can do it remotely, but while I'm at my desk, I can actually use my Stream Deck to turn them on and off with a single button, which is super cool, makes my life a lot easier. Um, yeah, 20 bucks, you get two of these little guys, power button on the side, single uh, plug on the back, and then there's your plug on the front. So I've got my two desk speakers plugged into one of these, and this is the one for my sub on the other side of the room. It's really easy, you download the app, you plug this in, and then you hold the power button for five seconds until it starts to blink green, no, blue and orange. Uh, once it's doing that, you, on your phone, connect to the Wi-Fi network that's being broadcast by this. You give it a name, give it a location, and it connects it to your Wi-Fi, and that's pretty much it for the connection there. And then what you do is you come into BitFocus Companion, assuming you're running this. If not, consider it, because it's pretty awesome. You can see this is not connected right now because that's my sub that I have unplugged. But basically, you search for, oops, CASA, and there's the smart plug, and you add it. And then you can actually, oops, why is this disappearing on me? And then it'll uh, it'll scan for it if it's already on your network. It'll pull up the IP and it will pull up the name that you gave it inside your network. And then you save it and you come over to your buttons and then they actually have presets in here. So you can pick a button, go to presets and it'll give you presets for stuff you've already got attached to your companion setup. So when I just added it under the connections, it now has a preset here. So I literally just grab a preset, uh, click on power, and then I can do power on, power off, toggle, however you wanna do it. I do toggle so I don't have to have multiple buttons. I just pull this onto a button. So you can actually add actions. And what I did was I added a new action right here and because my first one was cast a smart plug, the second one came up as smart plug two, I just added smart plug two so that both devices are controlled with the single button here, which is pretty awesome. Then you just jump over to your stream deck and you look up companion here on the side. You have to install this plugin. Then you just do a companion button. You drag it onto an empty button on your stream deck give it the correct row and column, but this one is where I actually have it. So if I wanted to reference this one, I would just do row one, oops, row one, column zero, and there you go. And that's all you have to do. Now it's active on my stream deck, which is super cool. And then I just hit that button and it turns on and off. And you can actually, in here, if you go to feedback, you can change the uh, background color here. So again, I have two states here off and on because I wanted to give them different colors. When it's off, it goes red. When it's on, it goes green, just so I know at a glance what's happening. Pretty awesome. So there, my speakers are on right now. And then hit it again, my speakers are off. It's pretty awesome for a guy who forgets to do stuff sometimes. Just so you can see it happening in real time, there's one of my speakers. Here's the button I set up. Let me just click that. Look, went green because it's on. Power came on, pretty awesome. Do it again to turn it off. Red and power's off. Yeah, boy. That's it. TP-Link, Casa Smart Plugs. It's making my life easier so far, even though I've only had it for a couple of hours, but uh, 
pretty cool. So if you're looking for something because you've got a similar setup or, you know, you just wondered if these actually work, they work pretty well. Um, yeah, that's it. Check it out if you want to. 20 bucks. See you next time, guys. Bye.